So this will be the Galleon Beast fight. And I'll show you my equipment. The main thing you need to do here is get planet protection off of Aerith as soon as possible so you become immune to most of his attacks. Right, so the equipment, yeah we've got Aerith, uh, Kate Sith and Yuffie. And unfortunately you have to use Kate Sith. Yeah, make sure Kate Sith's a leader. Now Aerith's got Plumosh Rod. Any armor which will give you five slots and the enhanced expeditionary medal. She's got MP Absorb linked to fire. She's got Swift Cast linked to fire. This boss is weak to fire by the way. She's got A to B boost, limit siphon. She's got Phoenix. She's got First Strike. She's got Magic Up. She's got Auto Unique Ability. That'll make it so she warps to the A to B uh, Arcane Ward herself when the AI is controlling her. And also Fire linked to Magic Focus. And she's got Enduring Ward. Now Kate Sif's got the Golden Megaphone. Armour don't really matter, but he's got the Gotta Damarung. He's got the MP Absorb linked to Fire and Magic Focus linked to Fire. He's got Gilgamesh and he's got A to B Charge Rate up. And Yuffie, she's going to be doing the Brumal Form Spam. So you've got a Crescent Sickle. Any armour which will give you, well, I guess not even that, but she's got a Speed Demon Keychain, that's important. She's got a First Strike. It's got A to B boost. It's got a time material. It's got opening A to B bonus and A to B charge rate up. Yeah, that's build, guys. The last boss fight after this, you only need cloud. So as long as the cloud's got MP, the last boss fight should be okay. You know, if you, even if you do use quite a bit of MP here. Right, so once you're ready, follow the power cable. Yep, you'll get flashbacks as normal. Thinking about bonds of friendship again. Do your best to switch it off. That chapter of your life is over. All we do now is go through hard mode. I guess until the third game comes out. Where hopefully they're not going to make the Sims as bad. But look at this pattern. I mean, second was worse than the first. More mini games than the first. So third could be even worse. Hopefully it'll be better. Um, but to begin with guys, straight away you're controlling Kate Sif. Use tactical mode, have Aerith, use limit siphon on k -Sif. While you're doing this, you're blocking with k -Sif, by the way. Once Aerith's done limit siphon on k -Sif, then tactical mode, Yuffie's going to use haste on herself. And in tactical mode, Aerith's going to use planet protection once she gets a limit from k -Sif. Once that becomes active, you kind of be immune to almost all the attacks. And you need to be quick here now, you need to kill him before it wears it off. So yeah, planet protection. So as soon as that lands... Like I say, you need to be quick for it wears off and you'll be pretty much immune to most of his attacks now. So Aerith's going to build up 1 ATB, then he's going to use A to B boost. Yeah, she's going to use A to B ward on herself and also Arcane ward on herself. I'm going to switch to Yuffie and I'm going to start doing the A to B spam by using Brumal form. So yep, start spamming Brumal form guys. And now what are going to keep doing? Yuffie's going to be doing Brumal form, spamming it and then in, in the meantime going to cast fire level 3 with Aerith and fire level 3 with Kate Sith. I'm just going to keep doing that guys now. Yeah the tricky thing is getting this going but as soon as you get that planet protection up you've pretty much got it in the bag. You've got to make sure you're quick enough to get rid of the boss before he gets a chance to do one of his few attacks which can still damage you and also before planet protection wears it off. Genji gloves could have been really helpful here but problem is if you put Genji gloves on Aerith then you can't get that planet protection off straight away. So you kind of got to sacrifice Genji Gloves to get planet protection off. So yeah, just again, Yuffie, keep spamming Brumal form guys. Build up two ATBs. As soon as they've got two ATBs, lob fire level three with each of them. Aerith and Kate Sif. So straight back over to the ATB ward guys. And we should get rid of him before he gets a chance to do any of his major attacks here. Yeah, as you can see, planet protection is getting very close to wearing off. But he's pretty much almost dead. And we have got him, I believe. And there we go, guys. Galleon Beast defeated. Yeah, try to beat that guy without planet protection active. He kills you in seconds. Get caught in one combo. That's it, game over. Yep, so Galley Beast, another Chapter 11 boss fight, only one more left to do.